Where will you be on the other side of fear, on the other side of your mountain, on the other side of your goals? When our truth outweighs our fear, we will commit to a courageous life. So my story follows a riches to rags to riches storyline. At 529 in the afternoon on May 17th, 1994, I was one of the world's fastest hurdlers. I was a combat army veteran having served in Operation Desert Shield and Desert Storm. And I was on my way to officer candidate school. So my whole life was laid out before me. However, on the same afternoon at 530, I would never run another hurdle in my life. I cleared a hurdle, landed awkwardly, dislocated my left knee, severed the artery behind the kneecap, and seven days later became an amputee. All I remember was lying in that bed in tremendous pain with my wife Alice holding on to my left hand and Dr. Mullen saying, you got a tough choice to make. You can keep your leg, use a walker or a wheelchair for the rest of your life, or undergo an amputation, use a prosthesis for the rest of your life. Now, what kind of choice is that? As you can imagine, I was devastated. My Olympic dreams, gone. My military career, gone. I questioned my identity. Who am I now? My wife, Alice, saw me struggling, and with tears running down my eyes, she, she just wrapped her arms around me and said, you know what, John? We're gonna get through this together. It's just our new normal. Had I overcome the amputation of my left leg, I'd have my leg back. Well, I don't. What I overcame was my fear, and not just my fear, but the object of my fear. Am I still valuable? Am I still desirable? Will I still have employment? And if I don't, how will I support my family? How will other people look at me in my current situation? Will I be viewed with esteem or disdain? This is what we dive into in the presentation. We are all on a journey, a journey from our fear to our freedom. I think what's interesting about John's approach, it's relevant, it's new, and it's different. Frankly, a lot of us have not experienced life the way he has. Um, a lot of seminars and conferences kind of dust off old notions and processes, and his is relevant and thought-provoking. And he's important now. This is where the journey begins with me. A new normal mindset, making it your jump, your vision, and your new normal mindset to conquer anything that's in front of you. We've all had to learn how to adapt as our environment has changed. So whether you are doing a live, in-person event or a virtual event where everyone is remoting in, or a hybrid event, which is a combination of the two, our team at Inspired Communications International works with you and your team to deliver a high quality, interactive, experiential presentation that leaves you and your attendees with a blueprint and action steps to embrace a new normal mindset and win the medals in their life.